hello everyone welcome to my new video and this video is for the people who are looking for professional jobs in finland if you are unemployed or if you uh, don't have a professional job and you are uh, searching for a professional job this video is for you i will show you few websites where you can look for professional jobs and i will also give you some suggestions and some tips that how i uh looked or how i search for my uh professional job and how i have been successful so i will show you my way to look for professional job in finland as i told you uh, in many of my videos that it is really difficult to find professional jobs in finland if you do not know finnish language or if you are not from it background so i will give you tips how can you uh find professional jobs and what is a better way to find professional job well there are always uh better ways and uh, if you have if you think that your way is uh more suitable to search for professional jobs you are welcome to apply or you are welcome to keep in your way you do not need to follow my way but i was successful so i will show you or i will give you uh my tips how you can uh look for professional jobs so first thing i will uh take you to a website where you can uh, see what is their recommendation so let's go so you can see here info finland this is a official website from the government uh, info Finland you can find all the information about Finland in this website so from here you can see find a job in Finland and uh, they have some uh, tips or recommendations uh, how you can find a job in Finland so they are saying search for vacancies create networks and maintain your competence study Finnish language utilize social media in job hunting social media means linkedin facebook then maybe some other social media youtube contact employers apply through well you can see okay so obviously these are very important points when you are looking for professional jobs and uh, you also need to follow few other steps uh, beside this so firstly i will uh, talk about a cv your resume or cv create a attractive cv so it should catch employers eyes it should catch the eyes when they will see a cv they they will think oh this is nice nice cv so this has to be attractive CV, and you should have important skills from your degree for example if you are a it student you might uh, give few important points your skills for example uh, your skill in javascript react maybe python okay maybe you are skill in uh, sql or database admin so focus those in your cv make it bold so they can see okay you are skilled and whenever you are looking for a job you need to see the requirements from the uh, job post so you will see the requirements okay what is the requirement for a javascript developer or fully stock developer so you need to focus those in your cv so they should match so when they will screen your cv if they do not match you are out from the screening so this is very important so you must have a attractive cv and how can you make an attractive cv okay let's go to the go to a website called canva.com uh, okay so this is a website where you can get very professional uh, cv thumbnails or uh, i would say cv templates sorry not thumbnails it's a cv template 
so from this website or uh, there are many website in the uh, in the web so you can browse any website so canva is one of them uh, so you can go and you can maybe write cv templates so you will see there are thousands of cvs in canva and just take one of these uh, which is more suitable for your profile and you you edit this and then you will send it to your employer or whenever uh, you are looking for a job you can post to the uh, job search place okay so one important point gone now you need to create a linkedin profile a linkedin profile is very important if you see that utilize social media in job hunting so when i was looking for job mainly i was uh, during my last year in university i was fourth year in vasa university of applied science i was posting uh, i was checking like every day from uh, linkedin and i was making application to those vacancies in finland so you need to do that and create a very attractive linkedin profile okay i'm not sure if my linkedin profile is attractive or not but uh, i got many invitation from linkedin and many uh, job offers and also a job interview from a linkedin so you need to create a linkedin profile and upload your uh, upload your online certification for example if you have done javascript online course or maybe c sharp or maybe any online course you have done or you have a certification you can uh, add those certification in the uh, linkedin uh, place then uh, add your github uh, profile so if you don't have github profile you need to create a github profile and upload your projects you can do few pro projects uh, at home or if you have done project in your university just add those project upload those project in the github and add your github link in the linkedin and add this github link and a linkedin profile uh, url or website link to your cv so whenever uh, a employer or job hunter will see your linkedin profile so they can see your github link and uh, if they see your cv so they can see your linkedin profile and they can find your github link so they can see what type of project you have done in your school in your university and in your uh, personal life like when you are doing a project individually or if you can do a project with somebody else in a group just upload that in the github so you might upload five to ten different types of project it depends what kind of degree program you are studying and this will help you and it did help for me i had like six to ten project in my github and i added that in my linkedin i added that in my cv online certification is very important for example you are in the last year of your graduation or you have already graduated but you are looking for a job you didn't you are not getting uh, interviews so you need to do online certification you need to you can use udemy or you can use plural site or maybe some other uh, online uh, platform where you can do online education and do some kind of certification course and add those in your cv this will definitely help you i can tell you and then try to learn finnish language as they are saying here study finnish try to learn uh, finnish language as much as possible at home uh, in with your friends practice with your friends and you can also try to give uki test 
uh, and if you have a good score in wiki test you can uh, upload that uh, wiki test certificate in your linkedin profile and you can uh, you can also upload uh, that in your personal website yes now uh, is about personal website so you can create a uh, resume website for example mafuzul.com or your name dot uh, com so and this uh, website link you can put this in your cv and you can uh, this is a profile so you can uh, create this as a cv so you can put your degree you can put your work in there and what you have done so this will give you a very good impression to the uh, eyes of employers so they will say okay this guy has a personal website i can see that he has done this he has done this so create a personal website you can uh, create a site like this uh, from google site you can create your personal site from google site okay this is not my personal resume i'm just showing it as an example i did it from google site is free you can uh, create and it's very easy so i did it uh, for the students who are interested to study in finland and it was like few hours i did it so you can also do it it is really easy okay next is uh, next i will go to the site uh, jobs in finland this is a very good website jobs in finland uh, official website in finland and you can look for job according to the area for example helsinki okay if i give helsinki i don't see any job okay search for maybe engineering and you can see where are jobs tampere has 17 jobs helsinki has three jobs let's click tampere so you will find four english speaking job and others are like uh, finnish speaking so production engineer welding systems system engineer so you need to see the requirement and according to the requirement you need to make the application after you make the application uh, you can email to the employer so uh, take the email address from the application uh, website and then email to the employer or uh, job hunter and uh, just explain like what you can do and why you are interested about this company and you need to write like you are really interested to work in that company and you can add your cv uh, your portfolio your linkedin profile link your github link you can add those uh, to the email and tell them that you are really interested to learn so this is the way you will approach you can be a skill developer or you can be a skill in uh, skill in something but tell them that you are interested to learn from from that company so if they do not reply within a week you can also call them just go to their website take the hr department phone number and just call them hey i uh, emailed you i have made an application for your uh, job search you have a open position and i did an application there so uh, can you please uh, tell me uh, more about your job placement or about your uh, uh, position open position so you can ask them you can uh, you can tell them you are really interested and you have these skills you are looking for job you are uh, open for any any uh, position uh, in that company and in particular you can do this and this so let them know like what you can do and you can tell them uh, you can uh, call me or you can email me anytime if you want so creating network is very important as i uh, told as i have been telling in many of my videos that uh, creating network can give you a uh, possibility to get a job placement so you might have Finnish friends and they might work in uh, companies, different 
companies and you if you if you can tell them hey if you have any open position just let me know and if they have open position they will let you know uh, in the beginning and you are the first person who can apply there and reference works very well in finland so create a network you can create network in uh, facebook uh, through instagram youtubing whatever whenever you are uh, in third year or in your university attend job festivals there are different kind of job seminar job festival and different companies are coming to the universities attend there go there talk to them and tell them that you are really interested so this will create a good uh, portfolio of of your face so they sometimes they hire those students who are really interested and who are joining there so they they will take your cv so uh, take your cv with you and you can also give them cv in the job seminar so one more tips i would like to give you uh, for example if you are particularly looking for a job in a company follow their uh, social media website follow there and uh, you can also comment on their success on their post and tell them that you are really interested in their social media like facebook or instagram like them and give their they keep comment in their website or in their uh, social media or community page this this can be helpful for you then if you don't have any experience uh, for example sometimes if you are new or uh, fresh graduate you might not have any experience what you can do you can uh, do online uh, job like you can create profile in upwork or Fi Fi fiverr uh, their online platform you can uh, do some online job and you can use this experience in your cv you can write in your cv that okay i have been doing fiber or upwork uh, things for two years or one year and you can write this experience this will work okay at last i will uh, go through a website this is a uh this is a very good website where you can get uh, where you can find all the job advertisement mostly all uh, in this website so if you go there and if you click personal customer and then vacancies and if you write like okay in software let's see what it shows here uh, choose occupational groups okay managers professionals uh, many different kind of criteria here let's see Helsinki maybe show jobs so you will see all the job categories here let me uh, look for language okay english okay so you can see all the jobs here uh, and you can apply there so this is a very good website you can go there and you can make application so last, at last i would like to mention if you are not confident about you if you are not confident about your skill one thing you can do go for a uh, short degree for example a six month or one year uh, degree program uh, from integrify or from some other uh, university get a short degree and this can help you so then you will be confident make different kinds of projects and upload those in github and then uh, look for uh, jobs from different uh, open position i believe that this can give you a opportunity uh, get to get hiring in different companies so hopefully all the tips i have given to you will be really really useful for you and if you think that these are useful just thumbs up and uh, you can also comment in the video what you think about this 
So, so see you to my next video. Until then, take care and bye-bye.